tell me i will ask them to play the guest king said what they are playing now is itself so nice <laughs> let them continue <coughs> then the host king was in no way better than the guest he ordered come on play it for one hour more <laughs> and the conductor was put to a great dilemma <laughs> but he was a very clever fellow what he did was about 30 40 instruments on the left and about 30 40 on the right he ordered that then one side was tuning the other side would uh, untune them so that by the time they had tuned they would be out of tune so it went for went on for one hour and the it seems the guest king presented lavishly to all the participants so in <laughs> this is not a joke it is said to be it is said to have happened already actually it actually happened so luckily we are at least the instruments are in tune now <laughs> the learned audience should uh, pardon a little of talking this is not just a program of music this is demonstration so there a little of talking might be needed i will try to reduce the talk to the minimum and uh, all of all of us are anxious to listen to veterans like uh, murthy garu and uh, Bhaskaran, our Jambavan, Ramachar. So, I will start with a small invocation shloka. <coughs> गजानन पद्मक गजानन मकर्णिश अगजानन पद्मक गजानन मकर्णिश अगजानन पद्मक गजानन मकर्णिश अनेकदंतमुस्मे गजानन पद्मक गजानन मगर्णिश अनेकदंतमुपास्मे अगजानन पद्मक गजानन मकर्णिश अनेकदंतमुक्ता दंतमुपास्मे दिस इज श्लोक कंपोस्ट बै आदिशंकर This is in praise of Lord Ganesha. I have a reason for selecting this shloka. This shloka has certain aspects that we should note. 
while composing a Pallavi. That was why I selected this. Agajanana Padmarkam Gajananam Aharnisham The learned audience here would understand the meaning easily. But even for those who don't know the meaning, they can be impressed with the sound construction of Agajanana Padmarkam Gaja Agaja Gaja Aneka Dantam Bhaktanam Eka Dantam Upasma Aneka Eka This Gaja sound and the Eka, this sound has been used in two places for different effect. This is not a shloka which is a random collection of words. Every word here has been selected with care. Of course, for a liberated soul like Adi Shankara, he need not sit and think. There was a flow of such beautiful poetry from his mind any time. But for us lesser mortals, we have to learn a lot from just two lines. Agaja Anana Padma Arkam, that is the meaning. Aga means mountain. Agaja, mountain's daughter. Anana is face. Padma. Agajanana, mountain's daughters, lotus like face. Agaja Anana Padma Arkam. Padma Arkam. Arkam is sun. When sun rises, the lotus blossoms. So, when Vinayaka comes, Parvati's face blossoms like uh, Padma. So, Vinayaka is Arka. Gajananam, that is, is very well known. Aharnisham, always. Anekadam tam bhaktana. You see, aneka danta, eka danta, that danta sound, aneka dam, he gives everything. Aneka dam, tam, him, bhaktanam, eka danta. Eka danta, you know, all of you know, he has only one of the tusks, the other broken. So, this eka danta, aneka dam, tam, aneka dantam. Like that. Beautiful poetry and uh, selection of appropriate words to create all the sophistication. This is exactly a pal what a Pallavi should do. A Pallavi is not a mere collection of, random collection of words. Every syllable in a Pallavi must have a purpose. Only that is a good Pallavi. Of course, the world has got good, bad and indifferent things like that. Good, bad and indifferent Pallavis are in circulation. But as serious students of music, we should look for the best among them. That is number one. Number two, the Pallavi is an item of a concert in which the musician's creative ability is at maximum force. Pallavi is the platform to show the best in the creative ability of the performer. A kirtana, a kriti, which is more often sung than a pallavi, is composed by somebody else. I am singing them. But in ideal conditions, the pallavi should be composed by the singer, by the performer. Still better it would be if it is composed then and there. Pallavi, in the ideal conditions, should be composed then and there. What you call in chemistry the nascent value. 
It should have the nascent value. It is created, it is born then and there. Of course, that is too much to expect for various reasons, not, not only out for limitation of the capacity of the singer. Because we are now in the computer age when the audience want everything in good finish. Anything that is born then and there cannot be in good finish. It will take time to shape. We don't have so much facility today for the audience to wait. This was possible in the days of Mahavaidinathir and others, when the concert duration was normally six hours. In those days, there were no TVs, no Ramayana programs, and uh, people had no other source of entertainment or something, and so Mahavaidinathir and others could uh, very comfortably conduct a concert for six hours and uh, have also a small interval for doing Sandhya Vandanam. That was the practice it is set in those days. So, they could take time, compose a Pallavi then and there, rehearse it with the accompanist then and there. All that was possible in those days. But there was a thrill, in fact, I would, during my practice sessions, I found that there was a great thrill in taking a thing anew. Just try it there, then and there. Fail, try it again. That was a great thrill. Once uh, a great violinist told me, we were rehearsing a Pallavi. He told me he was to accompany the next day. He said, these Pallavis, I will be happy even if I do them wrongly. This Pallavis appeal to me so much. I may not be able to execute it. Still, I would like to play them. So, like that there is an intellectual appeal in the Pallavis. And I will take a few minutes in just giving a small guidance how I would construct a Pallavi for the benefit of serious learners. Before that, I would say how, what are the main areas in which a Pallavi differs from an ordinary Kriti? Of course, number one difference is the Kriti has been, Kriti, the word Kriti itself means Kriti, Krita. It has already been done. <laughs> Kriti means it has been already done by somebody. We are only reciting it. We are only giving it one more rendition. It has been rendered by so many artists for so many years. That is rendition. Pallavi is creation. And uh, number one, that is difference. Other differences are in Pallavi, there are certain rules like a characteristic landing that is essential. <laughs> I will now sing one Pallavi and say what are the salient features. Pallavi which were famous for the past 50 years. I will sing one and demonstrate. Hmm. <laughs> hmm.
I sang this in this speed now. I can sing it in another speed. And still the frame will be the same. All the accompanists will immediately be able to follow it. I will now try it. Mama Duraga Pinachi See, without any rehearsing, they immediately played it. How? Because in the other speed also, every letter was at the exactly the same place. Only the tempo changed. Now I will try it this way. Mama tu ra ya halt there, they also came to a halt because they knew the construction. I will sing a little more. Me na rehearse it but they all followed it 
because I sang it in different speeds. Every time, every syllable of it falling it, falling at the appropriate appointed place. So, this is not, I don't think it's possible to sing Chakani Raja like this. Can you do this? Chakani Raja or any famous song, Sri Subramanian Namaste. They are created for a different purpose. Kriti, Kriti is a great variety. It's one of the beautiful varieties of songs that we have. They serve another purpose, various purposes. Here, every celebrity is taken care of. That is Pallavi. Now, I will demonstrate that it is possible to put any syllable there, meaning meaningful, of course. Ma Madura Meenakshi Amba Devi. This, in the same construction. Parimala Ranga Pagat. Meenakshi parimala ranga bhatte Chandra kala adharasam Gana lola karuna These are all famous Pallavis of those days. The same construction with different syllables and in different ragas also. This parimala ranga bhatte has been famously sung in Raga Kamboji. In those days, audiences were thinking that they are all different Pallavis. They are not different Pallavis at all. Either it's Parimal Rangapate in Kamboji, or Mahamad Raminakshi in Bhairavi, or Gana Lola Karuna in Todi, or Chandra Gala Darasham, Basada Shiva, Abdinj Padwa. Because they, they are worried about the construction. Chandra Kala Adarasa Basa Samba Sadashiva Sa Basa Dashiva Chandra Kala Adarasa Abdin Padwa. We used to not notice the term ba, Sambasa Sambasa. We used to say, even, even that Sam we won't say. We were just learning, capturing the sound and well. And Undarishanam Ketakamo Natara Jadayani De. Natara Jadayani. That is the pattern in those days. Because they were so much worried about the construction. They left the lyrical meaning of it with the winds. Today, we are in a better situation. We can improve on all these things. And in those days, some of the veterans used to say, unless it is the Sahitya kill, is killed like that, it is not tradition. Yes, even today we have got people like that. Even today, there are veterans who say, Sahitya I used to say, there is Adam for everything. If you only you care to, if you only sit and seriously take to it, it is possible. So that is Pallavi. Now, these were the standard Pallavis in the 20th century. Before that, in the 19th century, Mahavidinath Shivan and others, as I told you, their conditions were totally different. Hmm. They would 
very leisurely take up the raga alapana for two hours. In those days, no kritis were sung at all. Do you know? Our Murthy sir, he's, he's much senior to me. I would occasionally check up with him whether I'm on limits or what. Padegalthal Pallavi Jasti Padi, Kritikal Rambo Koravin, Mundalia. Kritikal Rambo Korav, the number of Kritis sung will be very much less. And there was a time only Pallavi was sung, nothing else. Mahavidina there used to sing only a Pallavi. Vata Piganapatim, Pallavi, and one light item, close, concert, duration six hours. That was the, if you refer to books, it is said like that. Then slowly, more Kritis came, say from 1906, I would say. And uh, our veteran, Ari Kudi Ramanjingar, he sort of rationalized the concert Padati and introduced variety. It has got plus and minus points. It is not, this is not the time to discuss it. We should, we would only say, Pallavi has the merit of showing the genuine creative worth of the musician. So, the Pallavis of those days, in Mahavadinath Shivan's days, 19th century Pallavis, were very much odd, A-W-E-D. Even though nobody in the audience understood them. Because, by the sheer size of it, one Pallavi used to be longer than, say, Balagopala. Another Pallavi to the length of Bhavayami, like that they used to sing. And the Thalas were also Simhalila, Gajalila, huh? mm. and uh, Simhanandhanam. So many unheard of Thalams. Even very ordinary Thalams that we sing today is hardly understood by a small chunk among the audience. Then you can imagine. How in 19th century, with that lower level of awareness for music, how many people understood all those difficult talas? But still, the audience were looking with awe at the artist. He is doing something, whether we understand it or not. There is something in it, so we must respect it. Like that it was going. But we are living in a more democratic world today. The audience have a right to know. Come on, tell me what did you sing? They can say. Everything the musician does on the platform should have a rational approach. So we will forget that 19th century Pallavis. They are unwieldy and not suited for our modern conditions. Then the next stage of Parimalaranga, the Pallavi which I sang, Parimalaranga Pate. These Pallavis have one great merit. That merit is, as I told you, Parimalaranga Pagate Pagate This landing. Parimalaranga Pagate This sort of landing at that place gives a sense of participation. Even though you may not know the Tala, even though you may not closely follow the Sahitya, the audience are made to feel that they are partaking, that, that landing at that place is characteristic. So, the listeners are attuned, or I would say it is not merely attuning, it is atrithyming. The, by, by the close following of the lilt and the rhythm, they feel like dashing at that place. And then, whenever you dash or fall with force at a place, the next immediate action is Vishranti. You must notice here, 
Then it proceeds after some time. This Pallavi of the 20th century, these are all time-honored Pallavis, traditional Pallavis. These Pallavis have the main characteristic of a Pallavi that is known as Aridhi. Meenakshi See, everybody follow, followed that because it is a character's landing and it gives a rhythmic friction. It, the Mamadura portion of it is proceeding in a different duration of each letter. At Meenakshi, it takes a slightly different assortment and it lands characteristically at the beat. I will sing it again. That Meenakshi is shorter than all other letters. It is shortened like that to create a friction. Not fiction. To create a friction. Pleasant one. And it lands at that beat. Apart from that, this I will now say about how. A slight difference of Kritis I will say. perfect Kriti style. Here, that characteristic landing on the beat was not there. You may notice again. It is a just a linear progression of music with no special effort to highlight that point called Aridhi. Suppose this Balagopala were to be sung in the style of a Pallavi, how it would be? Bhagale go Bhagale It would come like that. But it does not proceed. Pallavi has some, Kriti has some other purpose. It wants to say about the Kalyana Gunas of Bala Gopala and it wants to infuse as much of Bhairavi into as less time as possible. That is the purpose of it. It is not highlighting the rhythmic appeal. So, if it were to be a Pallavi, it would be different. The main difference is that characteristic landing at the beat. So, these Pallavis were standard Pallavis, which I would say should be the starting point for the learners of modern times. But unfortunately, many, almost all our musicians have stopped here. They said, this is the Pallavi and stop, rest here. No, this is only the beginning. Pallavi accommodates a lot of more sophistication. Here there is no sophistication at all. The only sophistication is till the time of Aridhi. Aridhi is an important word which not only the student of music but all others may remember. Where is the Aridhi in this Pallavi? What is the Aridhi in this Pallavi? 
that is worth being noted with care. So, in this Pallavi, Mahamadara Meenakshi, that Meenakshi is the Aridhi. Kshi. Mahamadurraya Meenakshi. So, in all the Pallavis, you would have noted. This Pate is the Aridhi. But, lots of varieties in Aridhis are possible. That is not being exploited at all. Because our musicians, even the number ones among them, they are satisfied with this convenient Parimalarangapate. We are happy with this. Lark Sauri Mark Vashi Kirtuke, Yadanjal Lamarke. Idiya poor me, the Kelar Sandosh Padrale. I am reminded of Chembai's joke, Chembai Vaidanath Bhadar, the late veteran. He sang once this Purandar Dasa, at Purandar Dasa festival. He was singing. He sang for four hours. Next day was my concert. I went one day early to listen to veterans. He sang for four hours. All his famous kritis he sang. At the, at, uh, after four hours, one uh, elderly person in the audience, he said, Dasara Pada Ondu Hadri. At least sing once, it's Parandra Dasa festival. <laughs> at least sing one. He said, in those days, the audience will hesitate to approach the audience. Giving chit and all is not done so casually as they do it today. They, especially a senior Vidwan, they will <coughs> take with great care. Then they were hesitating to tell him. Then somebody, he was a very shrewd person. He noticed that something was being asked for. He said, what are they asking? Then the Shishya slowly told him, Parandar Dasar Pattu Vandu Pattu Vandu Pattu Vandu Oh, Rendan Nang Aicche Ne, Avar Rendu Pattu Yacha. He said, Rendu Pattu Yacha. He said, Vandu Kodu Kaya Kya. Then he said, he sang one more. There, this Parandara, Parandara Vitalana, Parandara Vitalana, Kandalo. He said, Kandala, don't ask me again. I already sang twice, you didn't notice, he said. <coughs> <laughs> then, at the, at the, after the concert, that elderly gentleman went to him and told him, the Sahityatla, you should know Sariya Purila, he was giving some suggestion. Chambai said, Oh, Rambar Aitakam. Oh, Narayana, Katuko. He called his Shishya. He said, Katuko, you are shoulder ready. Now I put it on Badway. He put it on Badway. That is the That is that, that sentence which I wanted to quote here. He said, With all my mistakes, I am having concert offers <laughs> every day. <laughs> so let the le next generation know the correct version. He was asking Shishya to note, note it. So that's what I want to say is, with Parimala Rangapate, there is enough popularity. Why labor for more sophisticated Pallavis? That is the attitude. I would like to have the applause without this, say, crease of my shirt not soiled. That is the version given by one senior violinist. In the shoulder of Tamil, the shirt is not soiled. So, this is the So, I don't encourage that attitude. The same violinist told me, I told him, 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 I told Ten percent to go to Panangur to the lay. Abdin or Sunar. Rumba Prama, Rumba, top rank number one violinist. Prama Vashi could ever. Sunar Nashone, eh? On a part to Aranamna, the various things, the Shatumadi Jagar the Arkamna, one day it's only an indication of your philosophy. Yen I can Shatuana wear a boat when it's over and an alabal with them part of it. I told them. So, a little attention to. 
more sophisticated pallavis i will see one of them and then at the end of it i will sing a pallavi in full and uh, our veterans will play a thaniya avartanam i will sing another pallavi vai bhave vinave shive ve gambe bro bhave vai bhave vinave shive ve gambe selection of words is is done with even more care there is a rhyming and euphonic effect in the selection of words vaibhave vinave shive and vegame that ve part forms of the whole vegame shikrama <coughs> not only this there is more to it vaibhave y is 2 ba is 1 ve is 3 2 plus 1 plus 3 is the construction vinave 1 plus 1 plus 3 shive 1 plus 3 there is a tapering it is vaibhave is 6 vinave is 5 shive is 4 like that this is called gopucheti that is the patterning in the theory in the books theory all the our students what is gopucheti write short notes on gopucheti all of us read it but nobody has put it into practice vaibhave venave shive vegame brovave in fact brovave is also another 3 plus 1 plus 3 brovave brovave vaibave vinave shive ve even while speaking it the effect of it the how from a broader phrase to the narrower phrase it comes this is additional in addition to the lyrical effect this is everything is as i said every celebrated nepallavi has got a purpose either rhythmic or lyrical here it is both so this i will sing in various speeds now it in hindustani music various speeds means gradually increasing it here it is not so here incidentally i would assert that the art and science of carnatic music 
is artfully and scientifically the best in the world. There is no parallel. I went to various countries. Everywhere, the most learned musicians in so many other countries, they fall at the feet of a Karnataka musician. They don't do it for musicians of other parts of the country. <laughs> they fall at the feet of a Karnataka musician because they say it is so absolutely scientific, correct to the atom. It is so very much. I can sing for hours together, maintaining every time that the way falls, way by way falls there, Shiva falls there, all the ways are in good ways. <laughs> like I can sing it for hours together. That is, that is the upbringing. It is, we, from childhood a Karnataka musician is trained that way. I will demonstrate really. Vai bhave vinave shive ve gave bhave vai bhave vinave shive ve gave All this duration, all of us were to the point exactly in place. All the celebrants were kept in place. So much of music was possible. We could travel in the music with abandon, taking care that uh, every time that celebrant falls at the right place. This is not possible here for any musician trained in any other system of the world. So this is on Pallavi. Pallavis can be sung for any situation. There is a wrong opinion perpetuated by the previous generation of musicians. That is, Pallavi is something very hard, something seriously classical, very heavy, not meant for the common man. Absolute nonsense. It should not be that. It should not be so. Today, a few days back, I heard somebody saying, in the last generation, the people were saying a Gita, studying of the Gita was meant for only the jnanis. It is not for the common man. They, they, now the present slogan is Gita for the common man. <laughs> like that, Pallavi is for the common man. That is my mission. And uh, I will sing a Pallavi now. I would ask you to judge whether it is in any way heavier than any popular kriti.
ಅವನ್ very heavy I thought it can be it is appealing enough 
to a person not knowing the thala, not knowing the raga. Uh-huh. I want all the Pallavis to be of this appeal. In one concert, I was asked to sing a Pallavi when I was about to end the concert. Three and a half hours party at one, one in the audience said, Sir, you are known for Pallavi Sandal, why don't you sing one Pallavi? I said, it is, I have sung Chilrai. Hello, pardon me, I don't know what to They said. Then I said, like a Chilrai or Priya, I will give a Pallavi. Hmm. It is possible. Hmm. Pakai Uruku Nilje Nade Pakai Uruku Nilje Pankaja Kandalai Yes, all this, I mean all this. Anamatopia. There is room for anything under the sun in the Pallavi also. This because this is light, don't think it is easy. All the sophistications are possible. And uh, this was composed then and there. Because they asked at the end. Pakai uruku nelje Pankaja not at all heavy with all the sophistications of a Pallavi now I will end with a Pallavi of technically rather difficult level I can sing it only when veterans stalwarts like them are here so I will attempt it now (coughs) this was also not rehearsed and so we may go sometimes 
out of situation you may bear with us enna ragathla paadanu i want somebody to suggest a raga somebody because somebody was asked many was asking me enna ragathla paada pore enna ragathla paada pore i said i was not prepared because i believe in creating then and there so i told my friends i have not decided what raga it is and i mean it so if anybody can suggest a raga we will take it anna ganamohanam ma enna mohanam ha mohanam and somebody has something ha vegada mohanam i will sing the pallavi and sing the other raga in the ragamalika we will round off like that modalla enna mohan eduthukuma sir hmm watch me Om Tagaganam Tagaganam 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 Om
மகேஸ்வரனை சதாசிவனை நம்ம சபா பிரசிடென்ட் இன் ஆனர் ஆஃப் ஹிம் தி ப்ரெசன்ட் பிரசிடென்ட் ஆஃப் அவர் சபா நம்ம சர்க்கிள் இன் ஆனர் ஆஃப் ஹிம் 
సదాశివనై మనమే త్రికాలము నినైందిడువా త్రికాలము నినైందిడు త్రికాలం అందులో ఇరుకి త్రయంబకనే ఒక స్పీడు మహేశ్వరనే అడుత స్పీడు సదాశివనే అడుత స్పీడు త్రికాలము నినై ముప్పొళ్ళు నినయంగ్రదకే ఇండికేషన్ అప్పుడు మీనింగ్ వచ్చుకలా మూడు కాలం వదిలి ఇరుకు పాతుకో అప్పుడు అప్పుడు ఇరకణం పల్లవి ఐ విల్ బిగిన్ అగైన్ త్రికాలము నిన్నై సదాశివనై స్పీడ్ ఏరింటే పోరుదే త్రికాలము నిన్నయం తిడి త్రయంబకంగ్రది స్పీడ్ ఎరంగింటే పోరు దట్ ఈస్ ట్యాపరింగ్ ఆన్ బోత్ సైడ్స్ గోపు చేతి శ్రోతోహతి
Vale, vale.
I will pin it in two minutes. Tamburi meeti dava, bhavabdhi dati dava. 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 Talab dati dava, surarulu seri 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 dava. Gajaya kati dava. Gajaya kati dava. Kalvaja mati 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 dava. Ah. Uh. 